Dad? Yes, Matthew? About mowing the lawns... Yes? I noticed that you missed a few bits, and the edges are crooked. I guess, but nobody's perfect. Luke's dad is. His lawns are amazing. Maybe you could be more like him. I guess. I'm just trying to help. You know I love you. I know. Applaud. On the ride home from rugby, let the ride belong to them. Okay, folks, we're really getting into the small black season, and today's game of the week comes from Auckland. There's a lot of action, and my steak and cheese pie is getting cold, so let's get it on. Kia ora Aotearoa, if you're looking for the best under-11 action in the country, you've come to the right place. Ponsonby Lightning taking on Waitamata Sharks. Both teams are stacked with attacking threats, but Ponsonby will look to their speedster, Josh Hargrave, to carve up outside, while Waitamata want their captain, Junior Nabarisi, to get involved from fullback and wreak havoc. Our ref is Steve Souton, Waitamata in black and red, Ponsonby in blue and black, as Nabarisi gets us started. And Lenny Anderson will get the first run. Find some space and he's just run around the whole forward pack straight into Waitemata territory and Nabarisi brings him down. This is great field position straight off the bat for Ponsonby. Wong, skip ball to Baker and he'll find Anderson the speedster again who finds Hargrave on the outside and he'll dot down for a five pointer. A mean start for Ponsonby Lightning. Blue attacking 15 from halfway as Samuel spills the ball and Inglis pounces quickly, unloads to Waru. This is good attack from Waitemata. Joseph picks and goes, and Chitara wants the ball. Oh, Regan Brent, he saved the try for sure. Jack Davey with the lineup finds Matla. Ponsonby on attack. Collins fires a skip ball to Anderson who straightens. And he'll draw his defense. He's got Hargrave in some space. Puts on the afterburners. Nabarisi coming across. Joshua Hargrave. He puts the lightning in Ponsonby. He's in for a quick double. Ponsonby go blind through Wong. He finds Baker on the outside. He's down the line. Ali is chasing, but he's in space. And Inglis misses the tackle. He straightens up. Oh, Isaac Wong. He's run a great support line. Nabarisi tries to stop him, but the ref blows the whistle. Ponsonby in for their third try. Set play here from a penalty for Ponsonby. Wong fires a long ball to Baker. Oh, he holds the ball nicely and delays the pass to Anderson. And Cruz Baker, he'll cruise in for another Ponsonby try. It's been a long first half for the Waitemata Sharks. They haven't had any possession. But take nothing away from Ponsonby. They've created and they've dominated on the scoreboard. Second half underway as Bennett feeds the scrum. Inglis, he'll throw a dummy and he'll take it into contact. Wadu in great support. He'll find Imart Ali. He's got his captain outside him. Great draw and pass. Junior Nabarisi straightens up and he's in space. Isaac Wong coming across. Junior Nabarisi only has eyes for the try line. Good heavens, this is a mean try. Waitemata Sharks and they're on the scoreboard. Ponsonby attacking through Baker. And holy moly, Nabarisi like a thief in the night. He's pinched it from Ponsonby and there's no one in front of him. Captain Courageous Junior Nabarisi, he's brought his team right back into it. Hargrave gathers the kick. Runs across field, we know he's fast. Oh, he's going to try run around the whole team. But Nabarisi, not this time, but he shuts him down and Wadu pinches the ball. Eri comes across to make the tackle, holds him up, gets a little help from his teammates and they drive him over the sideline. Flag goes up and referee Selton calls time. A great win for Ponsonby. 
Junior was a close game, but um, what do you think your team did well out there? Um, we did some of our um, defence lining well, and um, I think that I did my tackling good and well. You get the award for the best haircut today. Yeah. Show us your haircut and who's your barber? Uh, my barber is the Westside Barber and here's my haircut. Regan, good win. What do you think your team did well? Um, good defence, pretty good in the roughs, but not too good in the second half. Our um, defence wasn't too good and we sort of lost concentration. So what do you think you can improve for the next day? Uh, probably just fitness, keep on going in the second half and make sure our defence is the best it can be. That's us for another week of Small Blacks action. It evened up in the second half. Waitemata came back strong. But Ponsonby, on the back of a strong first half, get the win, 24-12. Ooh, the mighty Ponsonby, too strong and great skills for such young players. A few All Blacks there for sure. Shucks, should have got their autographs. Welcome back to A Day With DC. We're off to the gym to get them gains. Nice car, DC. You do a lot of travelling? Big snow, yeah, yeah, heaps of travelling. You know, if it's not on an airplane, we're driving, uh, driving to the gym, training. So what would your dream car be then? Dream car, I'm not sure. Uh, probably like a fast car, you know, like something like a Ferrari. Um, yeah. That'd be pretty cool. So Dan, how long do you normally warm up for? Uh, about 20 to 30 minutes. Do you enjoy doing cardio? Uh, I prefer to pump weights, but uh, it's good to be done. It's, it's good for you. Cardio is good. Well, mate, I think our warm up's nearly done, mate. I don't like cardio at all. So, should we go do some weights? So we've got about 10 minutes to go, but um, once we're done here, we'll definitely do some weights. Yeah, let's focus. Let's go. So, Dan, biceps first? Uh, no, not biceps. This is uh, bench press to, uh, to work on the, the chest. This looks a bit heavy, mate. Uh, not really. This is what we warm up on. To be honest. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'll spot you, man. Yeah. So, oh my gosh. How's it? It's all good, mate. Good form. I'm just warming up. Good form. How often do you train? Uh, oh. probably, we're in the gym probably three, four times a week. How long do you train? Uh, about an hour and a half uh, in the gym, and then you know we're out in the field, you know, for probably another hour and a half, two hours. When did you start training like serious? Oh, serious training, probably when I was about 18 years old. Oh, so how many got, got to do? Oh, uh, we normally do about, probably about 50 for a warm up. So wow. Yeah, if you more to go, yeah. So that's about 45, hey? That's about 15. Oh, my gosh, I think that's enough for us for today. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Oh, Jack, help me. Sorry. Guys. Jack. You know, I was only joking, right? I was just trying to make DC look strong, not shame him out. Jeez. Anyways, over to my man, Izzy. Hi, my name's Izzy. Izzy. Izzy Dag. And this is Rugby X Skills with Izzy Dag. First, I'm going to need some helpers. Kia ora, my name is Anahira. Kia ora, my name is Ecclesiastes. Kia ora, my name is Abraham. Hi, my name is Connor. All right, kids, let's go. Okay, kids, this next trick is called the crown. Watch me. Gonna balance this ball. Oh, she's pretty hard. Practice, practice, practice. Makes perfect. That's what I need to do. Okay, kids, give it a crack. The crown skill will have you balancing the ball on top of your head. It has an official difficulty rating of three. The key points are, oh, that was good. place the ball on top of your head, let go and keep it balanced, try and look at the ball, and keep the rest of your body balanced. My record is usually 10 minutes, but it's really windy today. Terrible. All right, kids, hands on the ball, here we go. On three, the crown. One, two, three, the yeah! crown!
and it's my favorite. And hot. Nice work, Tommy. <laughs>